Hey guys, Mr. Nintendo here. Welcome back to more Pokemon Emerald. In the last video, um, we got through the Petalburg Woods and got to this new city that our dad told us to. And in this video, we're going to be taking on the gym and going over the, the whole city. As you see right now, I'm basically doing that. Um, there it is, blah. All this crap. Pokemon Trainer School has a Pokemon crap. It's basically the whole area, nothing really. Um, there is one thing I do forget to go over here. Um, well, this is the Devon Corporation. We'll be, be getting into that in a few more videos, but there's one thing I forget to, to go over here. It's, um, the Mr. Cutter's house, or whatever the hell they call him. I actually, um, come back here in a later video to remind you about, he gives you the HM cut. Um, so you'll be seeing a little later video of that. Yeah, it's not like I can go back to it either because of, um, the fact that this was, like, recorded back in, like, early September, so, and it was already, like, edited, and so I have it all as one video, and cutting it all up in the parts just so I can fit it in there from the, one of the other Emerald videos and a few videos ahead, I just can't really do that. So I'm just gonna speed through this gym till we get to the gym leader, right? Alright, yeah, that may be annoying. There's only a few more videos where Ashley is dumb enough to speed through everything because I got a microphone. And some reason my editing system, that's a piece of crap, can't take it. But anyways, um, this, welcome to, to um, the first gym, whatever. First gym leader, Roxanne. Um, she has rock type, so if you pick Trico or Mudkip, um, this is going to be pretty easy for you. Or if you just pick Torchic and then just caught a low tad, like I suggested, and that... You can catch in that first route we, um, entered, right before Petalburg City from Odale Town. Um, but, anyways, of course, I can get my ass kicked. Okay, it's pathetic of how long this fight is. Look at the time. It's at, like, four minutes. Okay? Now, look at when the video ends. It ends at, like, eight and eleven seconds. It's just me doing something else. So, it takes me, like, four minutes to do this pathetic fight. Which actually kind of offends me how pathetic my Pokemon are. Because I picked the wrong ones, obviously. I don't know, because this is a rock. You'd think a Geico could do okay with this. Look, he just killed that thing easy, obviously, but um I didn't think it would the first fight would take that long, especially since of how annoying the next Pokemon is. But um oh, never mind. Next Pokemon after this one. Sorry. Haven't watched this forever. Like, I, I don't like watch it like before I record, re-record it because I'm re-editing this video with audio since I have a microphone back when I actually made this. So, 
as you can tell, I'm I'm pretty much do, giving you commentary blind, which is actually kind of pathetic of me, but who cares? Okay, um, this is her strongest Pokemon, Nose Pass. You can find these in the Granite Cave in Duford Town, which we'll go over later in a few videos. Yeah, it's pretty much a rare Pokemon to find in this game. Um, remember how in my Ruby version, which is which is an older version of this one, kind of. It took me forever to find one when I was trying to complete the Pokedex, which I ended up doing after like five years, finally. But anyways, stay on topic. Ow. Oh, that was lucky. Okay, I'll use my Twilight powers. Suck his blood, even though he's a rock. You can tell I make fun of Twilight because it's a new movie and I don't like Twilight. If you like Twilight, I'm sorry. I just don't like it. Nothing against you. I just don't like Twilight. I don't get what the big deal about it is. Uh, I see it everywhere. But, Exorb. I'm like, I was on Smosh.com, like, in the forums, and it's like, New Moon was like one of the most popular ones, so I was like, what is this world coming to? Ugh. Actually, I'm not surprised about it being really popular in Smosh forums, because there's a bunch of little girls on Smosh, too, not just little kids, because of the fact that Anthony, they think Anthony's cute, and they're all love Twilight, because of all that vampire crap, but... So, actually wouldn't be surprised that it's popular there. Now make fun of some people who smosh on, or who are smoshing on smosh.com. Which I even though I do it all the time, won't be used to. Go on there every once in a while. They're pretty cool. Funny videos. I don't know why I'm talking about smosh all of a sudden, but... I, I get so random sometimes. Yay, level 15. One more than Geico Evolves and two. Motorcycle insurance! I don't know what. He's still gonna be Geico, obviously. Wow, that wasn't even as long as I thought it was. It wasn't even that... So, what do I do for a minute, then? What? I have no clue. Okay, there's no way I'm sitting here for a minute. I got the stoner badge! I mean, the stone badge. You guys now know how Im how mature I am. I am so mature. Now we can use Cut Out of Battle, and he, she gives us TM39 Rock Tome. Tomb, whatever, I believe, yeah. I think it, that's what it is. Yes, it is. Um, so yeah, we'll go get that HM Cut soon. In a few videos, I actually go get HM the HM Cut, because it's, it's, really, it's required in this game, obviously, but I was just being stupid, because... I don't know, I was dumb back then. Still am. But that's probably it for it. Whoa, what's going on? The guy in the blue, he's taking off. Oh, he's got his drugs now. His goods. That's what he calls him. He calls him his goods. Well, anyways, that's enough for this video. So next time, we're going to figure out that problem and move on. See you then.